have been waiting to order this wig for a year. Yes, I am that patient because there was no sale on Henry Margot and so finally there was. I had it all planned out. I had had Athena before, like three years ago, believe it or not, in the color 26GR, which I sold. And I sold it because I wasn't that crazy about the color, but I remember really liking the wig. Now, it has layers in the front, which are very face framing. And I know this from the previous Athena, which I'm really glad I had because that's my reference point. If you wanted to cut bangs in here, I think you can. I would not. Bringing us to my favorite part of the review, the lace front. If that's not 100%, I am not happy. Especially this wig retails for $335. And I got it on sale 30% off as it was on sale at all the online retailers and I purchased it from Luke Studio One. No surprise there. Okay. So it didn't come from Luke Studio One, it came from Henry Margot in Pennsylvania. Now the lace fronts I'm thrilled with. I am wearing a wig grip underneath this hair unit. My Head circumference is 21.70 because I have a bunch of bio hair scrunched in underneath. And I did put a wig grip to secure the wig and I wanted to see if the lace front would lay flat with the wig grip, which is a sign of an excellent lace front. Well, look at this, I am happy to report. Lace front is staying put beautifully. I never touched it except to put on the wig and look at how the lighter fibers, which is the 60 and the 101, is so beautifully woven in, interspersed with the darker root, which is not too dark. That's another issue I want to call your attention to. Okay, this is not an eight root, it's more like a four. Let me just lift this up very gingerly. So you can see. Next, let's look at the air tab coverage. This I am so thrilled with. This Henry Margot wig, and I've had this with the Kenzel as well. The coverage is superb. I mean, it's just unbelievable. It's all the way down. Look at my finger. All the way down to here. This is the best coverage of any wig manufacturer that I personally have experienced. The density is very light. I do not detect any permatease in this wig, although I think there's an infinitesimal amount. So I think this would fit a 22 inch head. I think it's designed to be spot on average. Again, my 21.70 with the wig grip, it's perfect. It's not on the roomy spectrum. Now let's look at her from all sides. How does it feel? Like a feather. And again, I bought this wig with my own funds. Now, of course, I'm gonna do some outdoor footage.
and thank you so much for viewing. Until we meet again.